Hello everybody, Adam here from the Hammer Game Channel and welcome back to my Ching China playthrough uh, for um, several achievements. That's three. What are they again? They are the good, the bad, and the weird. Hail to the Ching and the Dragon Swallow the Sun. And we are making good progress. Last episode we defeated Japan within six minutes of the episode. And um, we are now ready to launch our naval invasions. Uh, we do have four whole um, submarines right now. So we're not completely ready to go. We are, we're getting to the point where we're going to be able to, we have our planes over uh, northern China. We, we don't have all too many that right now. Uh, we are working on them. We have a lot of guns in reserve, actually. We could go ahead and get more out. We could, we could get another 24. I feel like we have enough divisions, though. I don't want to go too mental because supply is going to take a hit. Um... I'm hoping we can knock out Shanxi and Communist China very easily. But um, Communist China may be more of a struggle than we we're kind of expecting them to be. But as long as we can do damage to the rest. China is the main one we need to take down. They do not have the government, not the government, the army corruption. So they're full attack and defense, really. Which, yeah, it's not the greatest, but oh well. Do we not get the... Uh, Grants or where where is that? Is un oh no, you're not classed as being in here, are you? No, nope, yep, it is. It's right in here, sir. It's a heavy tank designer. Not bad actually. We will be grabbing that. Gives us hard attack and armor as well as the research speed. King Carl's abdicated and emptied the banks as he left. Of course, they're joining the Axis. We will also be joining the Axis because of the uh, tripartite pact. It's the only way we're going to be able to get past that. Um, so yeah, we're we're just we're just building up really. I could probably skip some of this actually for you. Um but I'm not going to. I want you to see the whole working behind this. That is really put this down in aluminium. Naval invasion plans. We do not have enough convoys. Take a dockyard off of you. Right. Now we are six days away from finishing the motor ride, so we're going to go ahead and wait. Um, let's get you back onto that. So another dockyard would be nice. Then I'm going to start heading towards that achievement. So we're going to get everything up to six. You're not needed. It's just the five that we started with. So it is simply just these ones here. So we'll start by getting up to sevens. Yeah, it's literally just these five. Or maybe you as well. Okay, maybe six. We'll see. Anyways, let's upgrade you. Let's go and get the experimental mechanized units. Uh, and we are also going to go ahead and... Because China's not going to have any tanks. We're going to go ahead and request the license production of Panzer 1s. I wonder if we can get any of the variants. No, we're going to get Panzer 1s. No, we can't even get Panzer 1s now. You were willing to help me out, Germany. What changed? Oh, gosh. Well, time to go and ask for Italian armor. That is too good a quality for us. Tech difference of requested equipment. I can't even ask for the Great War Tank. Okay, sadly, we should have got the Panzer 1 before then. So put them back in the planes. Wait a second, where are you flashing? Oh, Great War Tank. Let's let's get the Great War Tank into produ production. We're not going to have that many divisions, let's be honest. But we do have 150 tanks. Got a motorized division template as well. An armored one, but not the greatest. I wonder what the template is that we get from you. I wonder what the two light tank, four motorized. We're not going to have motorized, though. We might have to change the cavalry. But um, having tanks in play, though, they're not going to be the strongest tanks, but they're still going to be better tanks than what the Chinese are going to have. I don't think they're going to have anti-tank either. No, they've got artillery. They've got engineer, though. They have kind of one up us there. We're going to get support equipment now. We need to get that into production. Um, but everything else is looking good. Navy is up to seven ships now. So we're, we're double theirs. We're over double. And our subs, they should be f good at doing what they're doing. 
Let's go ahead and actually filter in some military factories along the way. Like so. So we've got one more coming in. We're still a lot of convoys short for the naval invasions. They're not going to be going at the same time anyways. It's going to be one after the other. But uh, there's our one tank division. It is... Um, we'll go and see if we can take Beijing with, <laughs> with it. Combined arms, warfare, that's a mechanised. Let's see if we can actually... I might actually try and do that, because we do have more divisions in them. Did that just come up saying we're pure, pure cowardice? Oh, we had time to... We were on a timer for those. Oh, that's fine. We can easily just justify them anyways. I didn't realise we had a timer on those. Oh well. Might have actually hit our stability there. Might try and subjugate them. We are stronger. Well, we probably do have more divisions in them. It's worth a try. It is worth a try. Because if we dominate Japan, I'll have their navy to use. I'll have their army. I'll have their man put. Well, pff, don't need that. <coughs> <coughs> Could do power military. I need communist sweep. Is that even going to do anything? Communist uprising. Yeah, we're good. We're good. I'm, I'm, we're making progress. Um, it may not be the most interesting thing right now, but um, it, is, it is. We're working towards it. We have a lot of guns in reserve. A lot of guns, which I feel like we can go ahead and bring that down. And actually get some motorized in production as well. That's convoys. <laughs> That's convoys I've grabbed there. Um, 12 combat with. Let's just go ahead and knock that down to a 10. So 150 and 100. Uh, might actually be doable. Anyways, we, we need to get our army offensive guy back in. So let's go ahead and do that. And you know what? We have time. We have the equipment. We have the manpower. We have everything else we need. We're going to go ahead and produce another 24 divisions. And their support equipment. Let's go ahead and get engineers. Might even be able to get them out. Uh, we can start producing the equipment as well. So, what we'll do is we'll lower this. Actually, do you know what? Let's, let's be realistic. We're not going to be able to field out more than that one division anytime soon. And I'd rather have support equipment in on my infantry. Now, how are we doing for you now? 51 out of 144. As long as we've got enough to... Well, we don't even need to have enough exactly to, you know, completely warrant the whole naval invasion. Um, I'm going to try the subjugation of Japan before we go to war with them. So it is another... Th that's going to take three focuses. Um, I feel like that'll be plenty of time to sort things out. But let's go ahead and research naval bombers. I feel like it's something we're going to need in the future if we do... You know, don't get Japan through the domination here. I feel like they will say no. Oh yes, the renegotiate the unequal treaties is bypassed because we don't have the nine power treaty. But Imperial legacy gives us some stability, so that's going to put us up to eighty three. Then we'll be on ninety three once low legitimacy is gone. We could claim overlordship over Indochina as well, but if we have Japan as our uh, puppet, then hopefully we can just easily take that from them, like taking candy from a baby. Now, I'd just like to point out, I should have pointed out this in the last episode as well, but um, I've been recording these in, like, batch. So this is the third that I've recorded in a row. Well, it is the third episode of this. But, um, yeah, basically, I've recorded them all at the same time. So any comments I won't be able to take into consideration until the fourth episode, because I'm stopping to re record it after this. Are we using convoys for you? No, we're not, so we can go ahead and get some more steel in. The Soviets also have aluminium, so we should get some of that in. It's only leaving us 10 factories building, but that's fine. How many surveys we got? 22. Okay, we have well more factories than them. How's the navy coming on? 10. Nice, 10 navy. Good, good, good. Might as well get you guys exercising, as long as none of you blow up. That'd be awkward. Show me brings from all top of them and drop facts. 
I hope... Do we actually... Wait a second. Do we actually go to war if we do that? Do we go to war if they say no? Decky Chavez was a great start to our independence. They have allied with the Western Powers to subjugate us before. We cannot allow them to launch their attempt. We must strike first. I hope Germany's asking us to join. Maybe we don't want to go after Japan. They could say yes, though. They could say yes. But then if it kicks off a whole war, we're going to be on the back foot. Oh, we also had Taiwan. I'm an idiot. We got Taiwan, didn't we? Well, I can tell you where these 24 are going. They're not all going to be able to help naval invade initially, but um, what we're going to do is we're going to strike you. feel like I should do that. It might be our way of getting the Yangtze Creek out. They do have a lot of divisions, holy balls. They're doing Chinese Expeditionary Force. Not really working on what I was expecting to be working on, but they could get Dwight D. Eisenhower. Nope, oh, another ship's been built. Is that us up to 11? It's up to 12. Good. Good, good, good. We have plenty of ships now. We have plenty of everything. We have plenty of everything. I'm going to try and subjugate in Japan. Maybe people are screaming at the screen right now. No, don't do it. You'll end up at war with them. I don't think we will be. Oh, yeah. Don't have, don't have any convoys to transport those guys to Taiwan. Um, yeah, we're, we're not going to be able to move you over there, are we? No, we're, we're working on our convoys. We'll do this for the time being. We'll lower the production on... Um, on ships, because I we, we do have enough. We have twelve. We have twelve. Well, let's let's try it. I'm gonna try it. Please don't pose the war with them. You guys are all exercised, so come on home. Don't want you to get destroyed. All these divisions are going to die instantly. Anyways, if they do go to war with us, I feel like that could be a lot of their army. They are at war with the Allies, so this is going to hopefully help them out and get them out of that war. Um, and they'll become mine. I'll make doing this Dragon Swallow of the Sun so much easier. Like, so much easier. Is Stalin getting attacked? Oh, bollocks. Stalin is getting attacked. Oh, damn. Hence why Germany's like, join us. Well, I was going to say, hopefully China's not going to join a faction, but they do have the Chinese United Front still, so... Yeah, they're united together. Dominate Japan. Oh, we have a war goal? Oh, they have a war goal on us. Do it. I dare you. Any yeah, fortification effort? Kind of feels pointless. We'll grab the military theorist. Yeah, we had a lot of decision we could have chosen there. Reopen the burn. No, no, we're not going to do that. We're not going to be opening, reopening anything for the Chinese. Oh, we'll use you for them. Once they actually are able to move. We don't have any convoys, like, stuck anywhere, so... To be honest, we could just bin that. And what we could do instead is... A Port Arthur. We'll uh, land on the tip here. Try and swoop in behind some divisions, because if we could push down here far enough, we might be able to cut some off. It's there. So there's a option. Could for add them down further here as well. But at least that gets them away from oversupplying the area of uh, South Korea because it's not looking so hot. I don't know what the requirements are for Japan to say yes, but we do have more divisions than them. We almost have more factories than them. We have more civilian factories than them. Their air force is considerably bigger. Their navy is considerably bigger. They have more convoys. Um, we do have 73 convoys. Oh, yeah. Why am I shocked by... Why am I shocked by that? Oh, you guys need exercise. You also need to change colour. There we go. Fabulous pink. Really brings out his eyes. Yeah, we, we will probably... Oh, Jesus. Heavy inflation. 
Damn, the government not giving a crap about inflation right there. Really? Damn. Right, everybody pray to the Hoi Four gods. Oh, Indochina's getting gobbled up. And Siam's non-existent. Please, let us turn Japan into our bitch. I feel like everyone would just enjoy seeing Hirohito as my bitch. As long as it doesn't drag us into a war. Right, let's get recon companies. I know we could probably further improve the engineers, but... Oh my days, with 3,000 ports. Um, yeah, we can definitely claw back the production on you guys. Alright, I'm not going to press anything because I know for a fact we're going to be finishing this. Please. 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 <sighs> Sad times. We tried it. We tried it. Um, we could ask for a large ship over into China. One China policy. Give us war goals on them all. Well, we tried it. I tried it. That, that was all we're waiting for. So guys, once this focus is done, we're going to launch our naval invasions. It's currently repairing. Oh, wait, what? 75%. Okay, keep repairing. It, you can get damaged during exercises, so that that's what that was. Nice, we've got naval bombers research, so we will get them into production as well fairly soon. Good. Just got to remember not to declare war in Japan. But um, hopefully the allies will do some damage to them. Maybe the allies that really aren't going to be doing anything else. Well, Winnie here might do some stuff. They do have the SAS. Who doesn't love the SAS? So cool. <laughs> oh, I can't wait for this one tank. Um, they don't really look like they're stacking the border all too much. So, we'll probably launch the invasion of Shanghai first. We don't have enough convoys. Um, okay, we've not got enough convoys yet. Okay, 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 okay. Production, goodbye on you. Hello, convoys. We need convoy production. Because we're stuck. Where the hell are all the other ones? Oh, 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 do you know what? They're on this guy. They're... That's a bit stupid, I have to say. Like, why Why is 29 of them on you? I would go ahead and bin this naval invasion, but it's going to take probably as long as it would take for us to actually get enough convoys for this. How many are you producing a day? I, I don't know. Next is going to be produced the 4th of December. Right, we'll see how long that's going to take. It's three days to produce one. Guess what we should do is maybe even set up you guys. So request forces. 17. Request forces. What's that? What is that for you two uh, combined? 30 divisions, not too shabby. They're not going to be joining straight away like. They are just going to be chilling. I'll sort that out in a minute. I'm going to go ahead and start upgrading artillery as well. You need to get some more research slots in. Definitely. Alright. They're going to be a nice distraction initially. Hey, Long Yun, you have 14 divisions still. Go ahead and take them off your hands as well. Is that war goal with Japan there forever? 30th October 1943. We might actually end up using that one, we'll see. Alright. If anything, I might actually use these guys as distractions by calling them in and just letting them die. They only have 96 divisions max. Damn. These naval invasions are five more, five more. Oh, why? We might actually time this near enough perfectly. We, we are really good to go, though. We are golden. It's just a shame I can't get... Unless, actually, what we do is we duplicate this. And we'll call them the... Sh we'll call them Stormtroopers. Stormtroopers. 
what we'll do is we can add engineering to them and we should be able to actually go ahead and just turn all of these guys into them. Yeah, we have enough to do that. So we can change that one lot over to those divisions. When China policy is done, Romania, you can have port access. Right, so we can go ahead and try and integrate to bet, but we'll leave that for once we've actually, you know, solved things. That gives us stability. We could do with that. Let's go ahead and grab the bullet slots. I want to get the research slots, because we can probably go ahead and grab both of these. Yep, we can grab both the research slots now. Right, so I, I think we're good to do this. Yeah, one more. We just need one more convoy, and then I'm I'm declaring war. Are we did we get it? We've got it. Well, where is the fleet? It's currently really repairing. I don't give a crap. Never repair. <laughs> yep, yeah, still only got three ships. Yep, you're joining them. Good. Nice days protects the Dutch West Indies. How? Okay, anyways, let's do this, shall we? We can start the invasion. We're not going to probably finish it this episode. But, uh, a time to die. And time for you to die as well. Greens go, yellows go, reds go, you go. Come here, China's been called in. Yep, we're not going to waste any political power right now. Yep, those 24 divisions look like they're getting there unharmed. They have all miraculously survived that. <laughs> when I say miraculously, I mean they've done perfectly fine. Right, we need to cover East China now. Launch you now. Get you guys on aggressive. Get your ass moving. Okay, things are going well in the north. What I'm actually going to do is, I'm going to move this. It's going to be a long journey for them. But I feel like it's so much better if we actually land further in here. Rather than go for the tip. Just cut that little bit off. I was maybe going to send them down here, but we should be fine. Should be really good, actually. Just don't want to expand too aggressively. But um, we got the upper hand on them there. No, we're not joining the Axis right now. We don't need to. Oh, our boys have landed in the south. Falkenhausen is here. Once these guys meet up, it's going to be a formidable force to be reckoned with. We're also going to get you an aggressive. And you're also ready to go now. So what we'll do is we'll activate that. Get the Navy. Bin that. Get them on Naval Invasion support in there now. Glorious, glorious. Nanjing is right there for the taking as well. Oh, we've linked the boys up. Alright, I still want the majority of you guys pushing that way. We just need someone coming in the Ningbo. And once Ningbo is secure, we can start going back around that way. Good, good, good. We're, we're struggling here in the north, but it's, it's fine. Look at that one little old tank. Oh, you, no units sank to the order. Go. We have the convoys. Fantastic Ningbo has been secured, which means that division's dead in there. Right, Nanqing has been secured. Glorious. I think we're, oh yeah, we're losing heavy casualties in the north. Maybe we have to slightly pump the brakes on that. On the greens anyways. The greens I feel like are the ones that are... Alright, well these um, pinks now here further push on them. Yeah, the cavalry is not having the greatest of times in here. I expected as much, though. 
Yep, secure that port, please. Mm, they're actually coming to meet us with some resistance now. Mm, they're halfway to capitulation. We could call in the other boys. They are not looking so great, though. That's the only issue. <laughs> How many men have we lost? 127k. We haven't even killed that many. Probably the Yangtze clique is really going to even things up in our favour. Not that they're not really in our favour anyways. They're doing more resistance right now, which... Isn't really going to do anything for our defence on core territory. Damn it, that's going to be quite useful for them. When I say quite useful, I mean very useful. Greens, how are you looking for pushing? Because if we can take out Shang-Zi... Yeah, we are losing men. Man Manpower is not going to be an issue. It's equipment, which we're still holding on. What we'll do is we'll just put the factories we do pick up straight into guns for the time being. Okay, the Yangtze clique is here now. I think the warlords, will they really be helping out China? They do have divisions about, but let's be honest, they're probably just fighting in their own territory. Right, Fulton Elson's going to have to take a break. The rest of the front can continue to push. Okay, we've united up with the North Lot now. And we are starting to push in quite nicely. Now, how's supply looking? Supply is green across the board right now. Uh, worst comes to worst, I'll just have to start building up infrastructure myself. Mm, we lost 60,000 men more than them. We are the aggressors, though. It, it, it's fine. If we can just get through to this capital, that'll knock Shanxi Z out, most likely. So we are... The Greens are managing to do a lot better in the north. Um, which is going to be able to let me do this. Well, they're actually not in, so I don't really need to do anything there. Um, hopefully. Hopefully we're going to be knocking them fairly... out fairly soon. And our collective farms is done. Let's get that law university focus done. Get that research lot. Right, we are striking their capital right now. I'm going to send out a couple of divisions just continuing on north. Um, Communist China. I don't know how strong Communist China is going to be. They're, they're, I feel like they're going to be a really fishy one. Like, it could be difficult. May not be difficult. Okay, we've got recon now as well that we can put on those reds. Okay, we've, lo we've lost a lot more men than them, but in the long run, we're going to be victorious. As long as we keep on top of guns, they're not really going to be able to stop us. I'm hoping this is going to knock out Shanxi. Because if so, we should be able to achieve an encirclement of those Jap not Japanese, the Chinese forces up in here. They've not capitulated. It looks like Ordos is probably going to have to fall. Which, uh, well, isn't isn't great. I was hoping that was going to knock them out. We do have 31 divisions there for the puppets to sit in. We could call the puppets in. Right, I feel like you guys have hit a stone wall right now. If they maybe want to go for a push themselves, then by all means they can go ahead and attempt it. That war resistance focus is really going to hit us though. Uh, get improved artillery. We're not going to really be using a lot of what we're researching right now. Right, we'll start working on the tanks. 
Okay, greens, you also hit it hard right now. Okay, they are being a bit aggressive in the south here, which is good. Can use their stupidity to push back on them. Oh, I thought it was a gap there, but it's not. Might be able to push it from a combined assault from different directions. Um, let's go ahead and move the planes down. Um, it is going to leave us open for them to get the air superiority up there, but I feel like a lot of their planes are actually down here. We have built a lot of planes, actually. From not having any to having all these guys. Oh, we got an encirclement. Nice. Nice going, guys. Well done. And that is definitely going to be pushable in there. Do you know what? I kind of want them to have a wee push of their own. Get those casually up. They're catching up with us. Really do need to knock out the Yangtze click, though. That is a lot of divisions they have. They're probably trash. Which, well, they're not probably trash. They are absolutely trash. I think that's a fair assumption to make. Just a shame they have not capitulated yet. Yeah, they're trying really hard to break us. You've been wounded. I'm surprised none of my guys are actually leveled up yet for me to actually grab infantry expert on them. I'm gonna try and cut them off. Which we've got a couple of opportunities for that. It's just breaking them down. Yeah, they are trying very hard in the self. We should keep an eye on this. Try and push in there. That's a lot of... We can definitely push them out. That's four directions we're attacking from, so hopefully... Just need to keep an eye on supply of for ourselves. Yeah, we're starting to kind of take it oh proportion slightly. Let's go ahead and build some. Let's go ahead and focus on actually repairing that that we've lost as well. That's gonna be hindering us. We can stop production on our own stuff right now. The war effort is where the the need is right now. Guns, how are we doing on guns? We've got seventeen thousand left. Get even more in those. We can bring some office support equipment. Yeah, we don't we don't want rubber. We want the Soviet Union's steel. The steel that they're probably going to lose very soon because of Hitler. Okay, the pinks are good to go. Let's have a push for them. Oh gosh, they are pushing hard against us over here. I feel like a lot of them could be Yangtze troops. Right, that's our opening. That's that's the opening. Just a shame I haven't been able to capitulate them. If we can cut them off, it'll starve the Chinese troops. It won't starve the uh, the Shanxi ones. They may have just doomed themselves single-handedly there. Yeah, you may have just shot yourself in the foot. We are trying to push across a river though, so that is going to hinder that. Still got your superiority down there though, it's good. Oh, I really just want to take out Shang Z. It's going to free up a lot of troops. A lot of troops that I do need elsewhere. Trying to pin them in while the guys hopefully break through there. Ah, don't push back on them, just let them grind. Alright, stop pushing. Ah, they're really actually holding quite well against us. Oh, well, saying that, we might be getting it. Just whether or not I can hold these guys in for long enough. Right, get in there. There's another research slot, so I can work more on helping out our infantry. Let's do the research in the education department, was it? Yep. A 
they managed to get troops in there. Unbelievable. Uh, what's the chance of our cavalry actually doing some damage again? Doesn't look very likely. Ah, they've managed to bottle our plan in here. Just counteract in their their attempt at pushing themselves. Oh, they've It's getting kind of annoying now, this. And they've done more resistance as well. Provision defense is up. They've, those are all apparently... Nope, they're not the greatest pushes. I'll let them do that. Oh, they're really stubborn in here. I just want to knock them out. I'll try the cavalry. They're not really going to do that well. Saying that, they might actually be able to do this. They might be able to. Damn, they've lost 700k now. Yang Shi won't have that much manpower. Eh, they've still got a decent bit. Oh. Okay, the cavalry may actually be able to do what I'm wanting them to do. Oh, my days, we might actually be able to do some stuff up here. No, don't move. I need you to stay there. Stay there. Ah, oh, no, they've given up. Oh, they reinforced. Damn. Yeah, it was going so well, but now they've just, they've just dug in. There may only be two divisions here, but it's such harsh terrain. Mountain plus river equals just immovable. It's a brick wall. It's a brick wall. We could potentially try a southern invasion of... Why are you broke? Southern invasion of Yangtze. We do have divisions that we could divert away. I feel like we are kind of taking a little bit of the Mickey out of the territory slightly. Yeah, they pushed us back. Shang Zi is really being a pain in the ass. Yeah, we're gonna have to change something up. We're losing a lot of guns as well. Right, we're gonna divert the yellows away. We're gonna try and take out some of Shang Zi. Now we're going to go straight in here. So we'll work on that next episode. Um, that might actually help them push a little bit, be a little bit more aggressive on us. Oh, can we strike back at them? Come on, divisions. Come on. And they are being a little bit more aggressive. That's good. I really just want shang -Zi. Push back in there, but it's not really going to do anything. No, because they just get forced back straight away. Okay, 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 okay. How long is that going to take? Another 74 days. holding out for this. It may happen. It may happen with these divisions. Come on. Okay. Oh, that's not going to cut them off, is it? Forgot. Communist China's in this. Ah, oh, I forgot Communist China. So we're really trying. For, I'm try, I've been trying for something that really isn't going to do anything for us. Yeah, we need to take out the Yangtze clique. We need to knock out their divisions. They need to die. Anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I shall be back very soon for some more. Take care. Cheer by the now.